All right, what's up, guys? We're back with Door Kickers 2. We have Arc 18 High Risk Rescue, uh, small, medium size, uh, profane execution, difficulty hard. Central Intelligence has identified a possible hostage location in downtown Havana. While scouting the compound, agents noticed buckets of crimson colored water being thrown out. We cannot allow any more torture or even executions to take place. Infiltrate the compound and rescue the hostages. Okay. So we have a timed hostage rescue. Um, we are taking eight guys in, two shields, six long guns. So just gaming it a little bit because it's kind of uh, it's kind of hard to um, you know get an idea before starting the mission. We do have a door here, so that is going to be primary entry point, um, and then we do have a door here is a glass door um, so what we're gonna have to do there's also windows here so we'll have a rake and uh, rake and break or port and cover team whatever you want to call it uh, to hit these windows while we gain entry um, and then we will have our other four-man team prepared to make entry through this glass door once this team gets a foothold and can start pushing through so that is the initial plan right now. Let's see, what do we got? Okay. What did, what's he have? Let's switch these out for regular flashbangs. <clears throat> he has a flashbang launcher. Okay. We do have one wall charge. I'm cool with that. We have our shield. These guys don't have. These guys don't have the level four plates. Let's do. Uh, let's do that. Okay, so Logan, he was critically injured in the last game, or the last round, um, hostage rescue. So he is out for two missions. Uh, so we have a portion of assault team two filling in. And then uh, almost all of Assault Team 1. So with that, and actually, man, I don't know. Because I kind of want to set up, you know what we could do? Let's do this. Let's do this. I'm on. I have an idea. I'm on it. We'll leave two guys here for containment. We'll use these two. Well, we could use these two. We could just... This could work. I have an idea. We're going to use these two here for a port and cover team. We're going to use these two here for a port and cover team, allowing our four-man team to focus on entry. Um, the, the problem with this is that's a glass door, and we are also moving through an absolute shitty situation to get to it. Um... We're basically having to make entry into a hallway where we're probably going to get compromised and then we're going to have to fight through this hallway into whatever this is and then we're going to have a glass door facing us. So I think our best option is to punch through here, gain control with port and, uh, port and cover teams and then just go from there. Because once, once these guys' job's done, they can reinforce the stack, so these guys will these guys will stay to watch those two angles um, up until the point where I can pull I can pull them into a different area. But yeah, so this is gonna be fast. Okay, what are we at? Mm hmm. We're just gonna start by getting. Uh, Getting charges ready. Ah, oh, crap, they can't cross here. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Well, shit. I couldn't see that car. This sucks. Um, yeah, not, not much I can do about that. So we'll just try to get eyes on this door. 
So then we can cover that. Man, that sucks. <clears throat> that really threw a wrench in the plan here. Well, we can still make it work. Hmm. I'm trying to think. So I don't want... We can't port and cover this this window anymore. Uh, these windows. We cannot port and cover them. We don't have enough guys to do so. Now what we can do is put a charge on it and blow it and then throw a bang through it. Just to create some confusion amongst the guys in here. So I think that's what we'll do. We'll just do that. That'll work. Uh, we'll put him on cover. Okay. Let's just start moving. Charge in position. Charge in position. Because this is going to be fast. And the reason I'm not splitting this window is because once this blows and I throw the bang in, these guys are going to fall back in with the four-man stack and do a four-man stack. Okay, everything's set up. Flashbang ready. Flashbang ready. Oh shit. Oopsies, I didn't mean to do that. Here it goes. Eh, we're not even going to do it. We're not even going to do it. Just uh, get back with the squad. Shield in. And of course, there's a long hallway. <clears throat> Let's get these guys slowed down so they're all going the same speed. The jig is kind of up now, so we're just going to start uh, getting this shield moved in. Clear. Okay. Sadly, we're we're bypassing stuff. You have to we have to keep moving.
We're just going to plate that door. And we honestly may have to just ditch the shield and go. Not sure why it's... There we go. Go, go, go. I have to hold the hallway. Um, you know what? We're just going to leave these guys here still. Now, what I will do is I'll leave one there and then pull one back to watch here. We're starting to run into some issues here, <laughs> but we, we can't slow it down just because, you know, yes, the game says, uh, the timer's gone, but we really can't slow it down. So we'll leave, we'll leave one guy in here and we're just going to keep pushing through. Shit, dude. You know what? We're just going to get this hostage out. Thank you. Hostage secured. I swear if he takes some stupid route that gets him killed. Um, you know what? Actually, we won't do that. We'll just tell him to follow and get him out of this room. Okay. So we have hot we have eyes on the next hostage room. This is really shitty. How are you on ammo? You're good. You're okay. <clears throat> Get this guy a better angle. Oh, fuck. We're just going to have to do it. We'll just have to send in this team. Um, I have to put him on a hold. We're, we're going to have to just hold what we have right now. But we can kind of get eyes. There we go. Nice. Okay. Alpha, go. How's your ammo? Hold back. Back. <clears throat> oh, shit. Does the shield have? He does. I don't like the sound of that. Yeah, we're really kind of stuck right now. 
<clears throat> but we're kind of at a point where uh, we don't really have a choice. We have everything covered that we need to have covered, which is good. But we're really getting into a shitty spot here. Okay, this frees up. This frees up a lot of this, so we can uh, we can start focusing on back clearing. This frees up him to come up here. Okay. So I think what we'll do, we'll leave him here. We'll set up. Oof. No, I don't want that. I don't like these guys standing in the hallway, but I don't really have a better option because I can't put them in the doorway here because of this uncleared space and all this uncleared space. Um, hmm. I like this. We have eyes on this. We have eyes on this. We just need to, yeah, we just need to back clear. We need to get that cleared, this cleared. And then I think our best option is to work this and then just leave this section last. Because this looks like a pretty big area. Okay. We're going to be slowing it down a little bit. Oh no, don't do that. Actually, we can't have him come out. That'll work. That door is closed. OK. 
Okay. Yeah, we'll take, um, here's how we'll do this. We'll leave him in here just to keep eyes like that. All right, that'll work. There we go. Dang it, we didn't have to clear the rest of it. All right, let's watch the replay. Charge in position. Charge in position. Holding. Go. They're here! Alpha, go. Thank you. Hostage secured. All right. Stay here. Holding. So we had Runner and Bonden get injured. So that means Runner, Bonden, and Logan will be out for one mission still. Because Logan, this is his mission that'll bring him back into, like, you know, just injured. Um, so 
next round will be missing Runner Bonden and Logan. Hey, I'll take it. Again, we didn't lose anybody. We got all the hostages out, and that's that's a win. That is an absolute win right there. So uh, let's do a little debrief. First off, this car really screwed, um, really screwed me here. Put a wrench in my plan. Uh, I had no intentions of taking this this way at all. I my intentions were to have a six man entry team, um, or at, at the least a port and cover team here, port and cover team here, and then once one of these teams were. You know, once the entry team was going in, uh, whichever one had the least amount of visual or you know effectiveness, I was just going to pull them off to rejoin the stack to make entry. And if we were able to have a six-man team, uh, we wouldn't have ran into such such a cluster that this whole area right here was, because uh, we only had four guys to deal with this angle this angle this angle and this angle so luckily this wasn't too defended so we were able to push our uh, two man team in through here and then come up and save that last hostage and then they were able to cut off this angle and this angle freeing up some of our guys to uh, start start back clearing here and here um, and then it went pretty smooth from there, but it was, it was pretty quick. The initial, uh, getting to the first hostage was, was pretty quick. Um, the second one took a little bit longer just because we had to do the, the work around through here, but we got it done. So there it is guys. Episode three for the Iron Man playthrough. Uh, we still have not lost anybody. Fingers crossed. We continue to not lose anybody. Uh, and if you guys like this, um, you guys can throw up a like. That way I know you guys are enjoying this content. Uh, and also comment if there's a mission that you would like to see added to this little playthrough um, that you think would be challenging or um, just kind of fun. But yeah, guys, let me know what you're thinking. And I'll see you on the next one.